Hello, I am Dr. Nseva Sietum, a lecturer in Akwaibom State University in Nigeria. Today, I will be speaking on the challenges faced by women in STEM, that is science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, and the way forward. Women in STEM has, have faced several challenges, and this has been an issue of global concern among researchers. It is no longer news that women have been subjugated throughout the globe, particularly when it comes to the contributions they have made. Although women are playing an increasing role in STEM today, there are still barriers circumventing them from achieving success comparable to their male counterparts. Regrettably, women continue to have an incredibly difficult time being treated unfairly due to the unfair system. In the developing world, Nigeria inclusive, Women scientists face several challenges peculiar to their cultural, societal, and institutional norms. These challenges have adverse effect on overall performances of these women in the pursuit of their career goals. To address the challenges encountered by women in STEM and to formulate policies aimed at supporting them, identifying the obstacles is required. Research done to determine women's opinion on the challenges they face revealed that Women in STEM encounter several difficulties, including inability to balance work with family, especially when it comes to involve or when it involves leaving their families with children to attend scientific conferences and postdoctoral fellowships. Women also complained about experiencing some forms of discrimination, ranging from delayed promotions to duties or responsibilities assigned to them lack of institutional support and some forms of sexual harassment in the form of inappropriate and repugnant remarks, sexual advances, and actual unapproved physical contact by men in positions of authority while performing their duties. To solve these problems, it is recommended that there should be increased duration and frequency of leave approved for women instead. Strict punishment for sexual offenders should also be carried out Policies to stop gender discrimination and support women through access to funding and research grants should also be done. Hiring women and nominating women for leadership positions and awards should also be carried out. Mentorship should also be provided for women in STEM, especially those in the early stages of their careers. Thank you so much for your attention.